show our pride Whoa, 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 whoa. We always show our pride whoa, 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 whoa. We don't even Good morning, McVeigh Elementary. Today is Thursday, February 11th, 2021. Here are your video announcements. The weather today is a high of 28 degrees and cloudy. Today's lunch, chicken tenders, bug bite graham crackers, emoji fries, fresh pear, and milk. Let's all now stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and Pioneer Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I choose to respect myself and others by listening and following adult directions, speaking appropriately, keeping hands, feet, and objects to myself, walking in the building, being prepared to learn. This is who I am, even when no one is watching me. Terrific, let's now pass things over to Mrs. Verdina for today's birthdays and half birthdays, as well as those for this weekend. Good morning, Pioneers. Happy birthday today to Miley C. in fourth grade and Alexander E. in first grade. And happy half birthday to Mavelyn M. in kindergarten. On Friday, happy birthday to Cayenne W. in third grade. And no half birthdays to celebrate on Friday. Happy birthday on Saturday to Brennan B. in fourth grade, Lucas C. in fifth grade, and Frazier H. in fifth grade as well. Have a great day, guys. Thank you very much, Mrs. Verdina, and we hope all of you have wonderful days. And now for today's announcements. Our final reminder for the McVeigh Virtual Book Fair. Remember, students and families, it is the final week for the Virtual Book Fair. Don't forget to go online and check out some amazing titles for your child to read. Remember, books ship directly to your home and ship for free for over is over $25. Shop the McVeigh Virtual Book Fair all the way up until February 14th this weekend. Um, happy shopping and thank you for your support. Please make sure that you check that out. Check out the online link that is posted on Schoology. And did you know, students, if you read just 20 minutes a day, you will read 1.8 million words in a year. That's pretty cool. Even more reason to grab uh, some books from this year's virtual book fair. Be sure to order those and support our PTA. And now for some more announcements. Today's Black History Month um, important fact and figure of the day is, in 1849, Harriet Tubman escaped from slavery and becomes one of the most effective and celebrated leaders of the Underground Railroad. Very interesting. Awesome, let's move on now to our one school, one book trivia uh, question for today. This trivia question goes along with chapter six. What does Ralph want for breakfast again today's one school one book trivia question is what does ralph want for breakfast this goes along with chapter six be sure to submit your answers and we will see who the prize winners are and for our last announcement we do have a tubular terrific and totally thrilling thursday edition with mrs pacheco let's take a look hey mcveigh what is happening miss p here for a tubular terrific and thrilling Totally thrilling Thursday. I apologize I wasn't here yesterday for you, but I was off once again traveling all around the world to find you news of the weird. Today is Thursday, February 11th. Today is Youth Day. Woo. National Make a Friend Day. So if you are celebrating some of those Valentine's Day parties, today is the perfect day for you to make a new friend. It's also National Peppermint Patty Day. So I don't know how any of you feel about those York peppermint patties, but I love them. They are delicious. In news of the weird, the band Flaming Lips. I'm not sure if you know who that is. I do. They're amazing. They're wonderful. They started having concerts in a giant bubble. Yep, that's right. That's pretty weird. Awesome at the same time. Now, here are your random. here's your random fact for Black History Month. Did you know that one in four cowboys was black despite what they show in the cowboys movies. Isn't that crazy? I had no idea. I mean, I knew that there were some like Mexican cowboys because it was close to the border, but I had no idea 
that we had some black cowboys in addition to the ones that are normally portrayed. Well, anyway, have a wonderful day. Have a fantastic four-day weekend, and I will be back to see you next week. All right, that's it for today's announcements. Let's now move on to some shout-outs and kudos. All right, first shout-out is going to Kimball from Miss Cooper. Kimball, you gave a classmate a very kind and thoughtful compliment about their writing. You told a classmate that you noticed the effort they made with their writing and you complimented the strong words they used. Wow, that's awesome, Kimball. I'm not surprised, but you get a shout out. Keep it up, Kimball. All right, next up, Mrs. Cooper's entire WVA class is getting a shout out for using kind manners and remembering to say thank you and you're welcome. Awesome. Ms. Florence has given a, a shout out to her class, all of her class, both cohort A and B. You all had an amazing turnout for the Thursday class meet last week um, during our remote day. 21 out of 24 kids showed up. They took turns and they made it a fabulous meeting. That's awesome. Ms. Bakowitz class, cohort B, you are getting a shout out for embracing hard work by doing your, doing your best during testing last week. Y'all are amazing. All right, now we've got some shout outs from Ms. Ms. Builder back to finish out the day. Carson and Jaron, you remembered to use a vocabulary word nomadic from over a month ago. Awesome job, students. Y'all get shout outs. Patrick and Lucy, you used your artifacts from two weeks ago to help the class review the social studies unit. Mrs. Bilderback has given you all a shout out. And finally, Mrs. Bilderback and Ms. Simmons cohort B classes for perfect attendance at Friday's live lesson last week. You all get shout outs, fifth graders. Awesome job. And finally, one kudos today going out from the second grade team, and they're giving a kudos out to Mr. Swain, Mr. Fullen, Mrs. Verdina, and Mrs. McLean. Thank you for taking time out of your day to help second grade by proctoring small groups for testing. We appreciate you. Thank you very much. I got to tell you, it is no problem at all. We're always happy to do it. And that'll do it for today's announcements. Awesome job today, boys and girls. Have an awesome rest of your Thursday. It is Thankful Thursday, so be sure to tell someone thank you today. No school on Friday, no school on Monday. Enjoy your long weekend. Get some rest. We will see Cohort B back in the building next Tuesday. Um, cohort A and WVA, keep working hard online. Have an awesome weekend. And as always, keep repping that Pioneer Pride. Positive attitude, respect, and integrity. Determination and effort that all will see. Show pride if you a true pioneer today. Because we always show our pride.